Warning, the following story contains plot spoilers for Don't Look Up, including the ending. If you haven't yet seen the film, we suggest reading the review and this joint interview with director Adam McKay and stars Leonardo DiCaprio and Jennifer Lawrence instead. And then come back when you've seen it. Adam McKay knows full well how the big Hollywood movie about the impending global cataclysm is typically supposed to go. Bruce Willis blows up the asteroid. The Avengers beat back the alien invasion. Superman flies around the world fast enough to turn back time. Everyone leaves the theater cheering, reassured that life will go on. That is exactly what McKay didn't want to do with his star-studded film Don't Look Up, which arrives on Netflix Friday. A warning about the climate crisis wrapped in the guise of the movie about an impending comet impact, Don't Look Up ends with the worst-case scenario coming to fruition, world leaders don't rise to the occasion. Technology doesn't save the day. The comet slams into the planet and wipes out every living thing. Even the handful of privileged, wealthy people who manage to escape to another planet are immediately gobbled up by alien creatures. Did we mention it's a comedy? In denying the audience that usual feel-good conclusion, McKay, inspired by dark comedies like Drive, Strange Love, hope to deliver a wake-up call to those who would happily keep hitting the snooze button when it comes to addressing the real threat of climate change. We've seen hundreds of movies where the world is about to end, whether it's Marvel movies or James Bond or the 70s disaster movies. I think it's not crazy to say that maybe that's part of the reason we're not taking the collapse of the livable atmosphere seriously. Elon Musk was asked about climate change and basically said, I know that technology will take care of it. That sounds like someone who's seen a lot of movies where you know that in the third act it's going to work out. For people to see a movie that ends where people don't work to get the happy ending, hopefully some people will have a reaction to that.